return of our annual Give from the Heart Blood Drive. This is a time when we encourage anyone who's able to donate blood. WSFA 12 News anchor Judd Davis is at Life South Community Blood Centers live this afternoon for us. Judd, talk a little bit about where you are and the, all the other locations that we can donate. Yeah, speak. We got no weather problems here either. Things are great inside here at the Life South Community Blood Center. Bethany, I have to tell you, you inspired some folks early this morning on Today in Alabama. I talked to a gentleman earlier who said they were watching bright and early this morning, he and his wife, and they heard the, the report and said, hey, time to get out and donate. So they came in and donated today. It's, it's that easy to do. It's quick, it's painless, and your one blood donation can save up to three lives. Melinda Hines with the Life South Community Blood Center joins us, and we we're talking about the latest numbers. We're already up to 70 at this location alone. It has been packed ever since I got here around 11 this morning. Right. It's been an exciting day. It started early this morning at 6 a.m. at this location, and we had people coming in the door at 6 a.m. Um, and it's been very steady. So we have been very happy to see that. Everybody's having a good time. They're saving lives. It's staying here in the community. And we just want to thank those that have been out already today. And then for those that are coming, we're here. We're waiting on you, and we're looking forward to seeing you to help us out. The need for blood right now is significant. And talk about why that is and how folks can make a big difference by coming in. They can come in because we're coming off of an emergency need, and that means that we do not have the products that we need to fill the orders for the hospitals right now to capacity. So that can be dangerous in a community. Um, it's a perfect time to donate because we're coming off the holidays. We've had some inclement weather with some closings and canceled blood drives and that kind of thing. So when you come in and you have fun and we have a big day like this with all the different locations, it gives us an opportunity to have as many people possible. Um, all of our staff is out there, all boots on the ground, and we are collecting blood and that blood is going to stay right here in our community. So it's a great time to donate right now. There might be folks out there who are watching who've never given blood before. It might sound intimidating, but it's really not all these folks are here uh, they get in and out pretty quickly we even have a special donor uh, the yeah. big dog is in the house who is that that is Bo the bloodhound okay um, yeah so see I mean he's here he's been recruiting donors and he's shaking hands um, and we're just all ha trying to have a good time because donating blood should be fun it shouldn't be something that you don't look forward to or that you dread so um, know that you're saving up to three lives with your donation last year all combined locations you said we had about 234 I think it was total registered we're gonna beat so that we're about halfway there and and I mean it's lunchtime it's noon so we're excited about that we feel like we're gonna surpass that goal today so find a blood drive near you or come into the center here we have a, a Prattville Center at the High Point Center there so they're open until 5 we're here till 6 Six, and then we have blood mobiles in Troy at Mama Goldberg's, uh, Walmart, Wetumpka, and Walmart Millbrook. You mentioned it's kind of like a party atmosphere. We've got drinks, yes. we got snacks, everyone's having a good time. Have fun, Melinda. Thank you for always giving us your time. It's easy Thank to you. do. And Bethany, we mentioned 70 donations so far just at this location. The other four dona uh, donation sites have already got close to 50 donations, and they just started taking blood donations at 10 o'clock this morning. So this location will stay up until 6 o'clock this evening. We have a list of other locations as well, four other locations all over our viewing area. They will take your donations until 5 o'clock this evening. We're hoping to break last year's record. It is easy to do, so come on out to the Life South Community Blood Center. Join us. Get yourself a snack. Get yourself something to drink and help save some lives. Hey, you know I love a challenge. We're halfway there. I think we can beat last year. No question.